Hey YouTube, so uh, I just want you to know how, what I use in order for me to do night diving. So first of all, I'm gonna share to you the basics of what I need. So yeah, when you night dive, you only have like a minimum requirement. So I'll, first, I'll show you the minimum requirements how to night dive. So first of all, uh, what you really need when you night dive is your good old spear gun, this one. So this is just a short spear gun. So this is specifically used for night diving. So if you see, it's not really that long. It's like, I think 50 centimeters long. It's not really that long. So yes, you only need a short spear gun at night because you don't be uh, using like a longer aim for it. So most of the fishes that you will, you will catch are like small fishes. So yeah. So the other one is your mask. So you should have a good old mask. So this one is uh, it's pretty comfortable for me. So yeah, next thing is you need to have a mask. And of course your flashlight. So I got this from the online store. I think I got this from AliExpress for about $20, I guess, yeah. So I got this one, this like lights on for, shines for about maybe four hours straight. So that's good for me. And the other basic stuff is your weights. Uh, your weights are very important so that you will be able to sink because when you night dive, you're gonna be like spending your time underwater. So without the weights, it's very hard. And the other one is your stringer. So this is my homemade stringer. It's just a piece of metal that I put a hole in it and tied in a rubber so that I can put this on my wrist. So yeah, I think that's the basic stuff. So you can also have your fish stringer like uh, the sharp edge can also be uh, you, you can also use this to to like pierce your fish in order to kill it quickly. Yeah. And the other stuff is your gloves. So without your gloves, uh, it would be very hard, especially you're gonna, the most fishes at night are spiny. So your the spine might pierce your hand. So it's a good thing to have your gloves. So basically that's the minimum requirement that you need. So the second, uh, the other requirement, or there are other things that you need here is, Yes, it's not really required, but your fins, if you have a good fin, so right now I have my long fins, Omer long fins here. So this would help me a lot in propelling underwater. And the other thing is your wetsuit. It's not really, you don't really need your wetsuit that much when you swim here, because especially the weather here in the Philippines is kind of tropical. So it's not really that cold at night. So this is kind of optional. So if you have a wetsuit, it's good, but if you don't have any wetsuit, then you're still good to go. The other thing that I have is my knife. So I don't really need my knife that much. But yeah, for emergency purposes and for killing fishes, you can have your knife. But it's not really a must-have since I can kill my fishes with my stringer. Yeah. And uh, last but not the least, it's your camera and your GoPro. You can put this on your head like, to document your fishing trip. So yeah, this is, these are the basic things that you need. When you want to spearfish at night here in the Philippines, you don't really need that much. So if you have anything else you want to comment, then go leave a comment here at YouTube and if you have anything that you need, yeah. So feel free to like and subscribe this video if you want. Okay, till next time.